I'm drawing on the computer for my art project. No, Moby. You don't actually draw on the computer. How do we use computers? Computers are powerful tools that we use to do many different things. We can use them to create writing, artwork, and even movies. We can use computers to make or play games, too. We use computers to communicate with people by chatting, email, or blogging. We can also use computers to find information on the internet. Not all computers look the same. A desktop computer is meant to be used on a table or desk. A laptop or notebook computer is much smaller and it can be carried around. All computers have software and hardware. What is computer hardware? The parts of the computer you can touch are called hardware. Some hardware is used to put information into the computer. You can use a keyboard to type into the computer and you can use a mouse to point to and select different things on the screen. A scanner copies a picture and sends it into the computer. Web cameras can input video directly into your computer. Other digital cameras can be used to capture images and the images can be copied into the computer. You can use a microphone to record things into your computer too. Some hardware puts out information so you can see or hear it. Monitors show information on screens. Printers put information on paper. And speakers put out sound so you can listen. That's the modem. It connects to the internet and works with your computer to send out and take in information. How does a computer work with information? That's the CPU, which stands for Central Processing Unit. It's kind of like the computer's brain, and it tells all the other parts what to do. The CPU works with the computer's memory, which stores information. In some computers, the CPU is attached to the monitor. A computer also has a hard disk drive, or hard drive. That's the piece of hardware that holds a lot of information and stores most of your files. It also stores your computer software. What is software? Software gives instructions to the hardware and tells it what to do and how to do it. Our computers have software programs that help us go on the internet. They also have writing and drawing software and even games. If you load a CD or DVD into the drive, a program will read the information on it and play it. You can even use software to create your own music. Computers are useful tools. They can gather information and help us understand it. Computers are tools that help us learn and explore. You built your own computer? I'm not sure that's gonna work out, Moby.